It's like the butter shot directly from a Swiss cow into my mouth. And yet, still can't enjoy it. I can't believe you're just quitting, walking away from everything. I'm not. I'm walking toward something. I can't believe you were just going to leave without saying goodbye to Ellie, though. Ellie is going away to do something that she wants to do, and I'm happy for her and Devin. So that's it. You're throwing away your life from Bartowski. I'm making a life. I've been tasked to retrieve you. Yeah, I know why you're here, Casey, and we're not going back. But you're a spy, man. I mean, this is the coolest thing that's ever happened to us. I know what it means to make a choice like this. I won't stop you. Thank you. Unless you want me to. I thought this was everything that you ever wanted. It is, okay? It is, but I want Sarah more. Look, no matter how much I want to be a spy, I want Chuck more. I interject. No. no. So I ha if I have to choose between the two, I I choose Sarah. Does it have to be a choice? I don't know. Excuse me. Look, Sarah has been a spy her entire life. And now she's willing to give up everything that she has ever known to be with me, man. Me. It doesn't have to be all or nothing. No, I can't risk it. This is what he wants. And if this is what she wants, then I'm not going to risk losing her again. OK. Fine. Just do me this favor. Before you quit, make damn sure that quitting is what she wants. All right, enough of this. If you two are going to go, you better go now before the other Interpol team gets here. Right now? Yeah. We'll hand, hand him over. over. Well, I will. Perhaps we should all share some nut cake before you go, especially you two. Open communication is very important. Oh, shut up. All right. Let me say goodbye, huh? I love you, Ben. I love you, too. I miss you. Thank you, Casey. Mm -hmm. hey, take care of my boy. Mm -hmm. All right. Move. It's really weird leaving. I mean, I've never lived anywhere outside of California before, so. Well, I've lived all over the world, but uh, Alford Bank's the only place that ever felt like home.